In this video, I'll be testing a single transistor FM receiver inside a metal enclosure. Using a metal enclosure takes this circuit from a simple toy level RF experiment to a much more serious RF application. This is a super regenerative FM receiver built using just one transistor. At the heart of the circuit is a BF494 transistor. This single transistor works simultaneously as an RF amplifier, an oscillator, and an FM detector. Thanks to the metal enclosure, external interference is reduced, frequency stability is improved, and tuning becomes far more repeatable. This project clearly shows how FM reception is possible with only a handful of components. It's a simple circuit, but a very educational one, especially if you want to understand the fundamentals of RF and analog radio design. RV1 is the most critical part of this circuit. This 47 kilo ohm potentiometer controls the regeneration level. Turn it up. Sensitivity increases, but noise goes up too. Turn it too far, and the circuit starts oscillating. Right at that edge, you get the cleanest reception. The output signal can be connected directly to a high impedance earphone or to a small audio amplifier. Single transistor FM receivers can usually receive only strong local FM signals. They're very sensitive, but their selectivity is limited. That's why they work well with nearby powerful stations but not with weak or distant broadcasts. I'm powering up the circuit and running a test. Right now it's around 150 megahertz. To bring the frequency down, I'll add two more turns to the L1 coil. By adjusting the coil, we move closer to the FM band. Now, I've reached the spectrum I was aiming for, and I'm right inside the FM band. The receiver is now tuned correctly. Up next, it's time to test the single transistor FM receiver. Let's check out the results.